This feels like a big mini. And it might be accessory, but I don't know. Let's see. Hi everyone, it's me, your very own golden boy, and today we're gonna open some mini brand series 4. This is long overdue and god help me, I'm gonna open all of them. As you can see here, we have 24 balls and that's literally a full case of mini brand series 4. We have a lot to go through, so let's just start opening. Oh, look at that, we have a credit card. <laughs> so this is obviously one of those credit card readers. It says Mini Brands Corporate, and I wonder who that person is over there. Either way, I'm pretty sure this is a new one, but we're not gonna put it together now because whenever I get accessories in my collection, I just wanna keep them like this, unbuilt. Oh, I thought this is mouthwash. Well, I mean, I guess it still might be, but it says for toothache, analgesic, and astrogen rinse. I guess it just numbs your mouth if you have a toothache or something. Collector's Guide and the Hershey's Miniatures Bag. I know for sure we have this one, but there's a lot that I don't know, meaning like I don't know which ones I have and don't have because I haven't been opening these in a while, so please bear with me. All right, and then here we have the Teddy Grahams chocolate chip. Chocolatey chip, my bad. It's a box and by now you guys should know what I think about boxes. And in here, I think this definitely is a new one. We got the Juicy Juice Apple Juice. Another box, but I mean, it looks pretty good. Oh, what is this? We got a Hawaiian Tropic Dark Tanning Oil. Interesting. If I remember correctly, they worked with this company for Series 1. I think there was some Series 1 mini brands that were from Hawaiian Tropic. Okay, I think we have nail polish. Yeah, this is definitely some red nail polish. And speaking of nails or hands, my hands are looking pretty good and clean right now. But as I open more and more of these, they're gonna start looking bad. So I apologize in advance. Collector's guide. And we have here one of my favorite things, chocolate. More specifically, we have some Hershey's Kisses. I know for sure this is a new one to our collection. So we're gonna pull up that list and add a check mark next to it. Oh, that is crazy. Uh, I think we have this one already. The Itsu Katsu rice noodles. And it's supposed to be rare, obviously, because it's metallic. But this is the second one I, I got. And I, I didn't open that many balls, to be honest. And then here we have some diapers. Some luxury diapers. My bad. It's a little bit disappointed that it's a box. I'm guessing that's how it is in the stores. No way. We got a gold one. This is crazy. We got the OxyClean Gold Mini. Wow, that is insane. This is my, I don't even know, maybe my 10th ball that I opened since Series 4 is released. Maybe a little bit more than that. I really hope that by now you guys have found some of the Series 4 in the stores. If you didn't, just don't give up. Eventually they're gonna have them. Hey, we got the Pringles. I think I said it before, but this is uh, this is one of my favorite minis. It's nicely made. It's pretty perfect. I mean, it's easy to make, obviously, but still. Maybe it's also because I love Pringles a lot. Who knows? And in here we have the Whoppers. We already got this one, so it's a double. Oh, that looks clear and pretty cool, to be honest. It blended really nicely with the inside of the capsule because it's clear and then there's this blue on it. But anyway, this is the Bactive hand sanitizer. See, from this side, you can't tell that it's empty, but from this side, you can obviously tell that there's nothing inside it. It would have been cool if they made it in such a way that, you know, gives the illusion that there's stuff inside it. Oh, seems like TJ Fridays is back. We had quite a few of these in uh, series three. This is the potato skins, cheddar, and bacon. I don't think I ever had potato skins. I mean, not just from TJ Fridays, but from anywhere. So maybe it's best if I just go to a TJ Fridays and get them there instead of the frozen ones, right? So far, the zipping part has been really good on these balls. I hope it's gonna, you know, stay the same throughout the video because we all know how frustrating it can be when it doesn't unzip and it, you know, keeps ripping off piece by piece. This is definitely another new one. Again, the Hawaiian Tropic Silk Hydration Clear Spray Sunscreen. Okay, interesting. Looks really good though. And it has it has a little bit of weight to it. I didn't expect that. I thought it's gonna be a little bit more um, light, especially cause as you can see there it says weightless. Yeah, no, never mind. I was just trying to make a joke there. <laughs> Honey, some Billy B honey. I think last time I checked this is from Canada. That's why I didn't see it around here anywhere. 
What is this? Oh, Almond Joy, of course. This is just another one of my favorite candy bars. The combination between coconut, chocolate, and almonds, I think it's fantastic. Whoever came up with this, yeah, kudos to them. Been a while since I had one of these though, so yeah. It's funny how many brands makes you go buy stuff, right? Okay, this is um, makeup. I know you guys told me what this is, but I, I forgot. I'm sorry. It says powder blush. And that's what it is. It's powder blush. We already have it, so let's move on. We have finally gotten an accessory. Sorry, but I'm not going to build it right now. Probably going to do a short at one point and just build all of them and be done with it. But right now, let's just move on to the next one. Oh boy, we got more nail polish. I hope I'm not gonna have dozens and dozens of these. Yep, kind of figure what this is. It's the Hershey's milk chocolate. My mouth waters every time I say the word chocolate. This is this is crazy. And we got some cleaning supplies here. Let's see, the OxyClean laundry and more stain remover. Now this mini looks really, really cool. I mean, it's very detailed. It literally looks like it's a real one, but in miniature. Like you would expect that if you pull this, it's actually gonna work. It, it's not, obviously. These would probably cost a fortune if they do. And we got more diapers, more luxury diapers. Oh, that's new. We got ourselves some deodorant from Arm and Hammer. It looks pretty good. It's interesting how they, you know, get to do deals with companies that are not as big. I mean, okay, Arm and Hammer is a big company, but I don't think it is when it comes to deodorant, right? And I'm guessing it's just that they cannot secure a contract or they're asking for something in return that's too much for them. Who knows? But if I had, you know, the mini brands company, obviously my goal would be to get, you know, some of the most famous brands to collaborate with. Anyway, just an interesting thought. You know what this is? This is some cereal. We got the Kellogg's Frosted Flakes with that tiger that is very well known. I forgot his name. I think it's Tony, right? Oh yeah, there it is. Tony. Tony the Tiger. It says 42% more free. So if it was the regular box, I, I don't want to imagine how small would that be. We got a collector guide. Look at that. That is so cool. I'm just kidding. <laughs> But I think we do. Yeah, we do have a new one here, though. We got the Swizzles Drumstick Squishies. Is it Squashies or Squishies? It looks like Squashies, right? That's interesting. I think Swizzles is a more European or maybe UK brand because I haven't seen any Swizzles products around here. So all my UK viewers, do you guys have this in, uh, in the UK? Is it like a popular brand over there? Let me know in the comments. Oh, yeah, I remember this. This is such a... Wait, what? I was gonna say this is such a nostalgic thing because it's, um, I used to have this as a kid. I didn't grow up here, but my grandma used to send us, you know, candy and stuff from here. And I used to have this come a lot. All right, the reason I'm trying to open it is because, listen to this. There's like stuff inside there, but I cannot open it. I don't think it actually does open. You know what that means, right? I'm definitely gonna do a video where I open some of these and see exactly what's inside, especially this one. I mean, that is weird. Okay, let's, uh, let's move on to the next one. <gasps> we got a Bitcoin. It would have been nice if it was a real one, but let's just take a moment here to appreciate the way they actually package this one. See, they didn't just throw it in there. They built this thing. Oh, wait, this is not. I thought this is plastic, guys. This is actually metal. Wow, many brands got fancy. Good job, guys. Good job. But anyway, what I was saying is um, I like how they built this custom plastic thingy to hold the Bitcoin. And then here we got some Itsu Hoisin, Hoisin Duck. Six bao buns. That looks delicious. I think I might have looked this up, but um, Itsu is another brand that's really popular in the UK because I didn't see any of these around here. And when I searched them up on the internet, they had that thing where you can search by location and all of them were in the UK. So unfortunately, I'm not going to get to try these anytime soon, but hey, it's a new mini. So let's uh, put a check mark next to it. Okay, what do we have here? We got the Batiste Dry Shampoo. I think we either got this one in a different ball that we opened or it was part of that um, collector's case. Or maybe there's like two types and one of them was part of the collector's case. Hey, if it's new, you're gonna see it marked on the list right now. If not, then we're just gonna move on and open the next one. Oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about. White Reese's Peanut Butter Cups. Mm-hmm. 
king size. I wonder how many come in a king size. Is it four? Duh, it says right there. Four white creme and peanut butter cups. Quick question, if you have to choose between the milk chocolate Reese's and the white chocolate Reese's, which one would you go for? Let's see what we got in here. Seems like we got some raisins. Sun-made organic raisins. We already have this many, I know that for a fact. Although there's a couple different versions of this, I think. I really don't like boxes. And we got another one. We got the Teddy Grahams chocolatey chip. Hey, look at that. Otter Pops are back. Uh, this time it's a different type of um, packaging and it's called the Giant Otter Pops. I wish they had a mini brand series that would be called no boxes, no cardboard, just plastic minis. See what I have to deal with sometimes? <laughs> this is not cool. Okay, we got more raisins here. More sun-made raisins. Wait, this was different, guys. Yeah, look at that. The previous one was organic raisins. These are just, you know, regular raisins. I was so confident about this. I think this is the one I don't have. And if that's the case, you probably saw me pulling up the list and marking it as found. Anyway, more of that toothache uh, remedy. God, I'm not missing toothaches. Some of the worst pain in the world, right? We got another Swizzles drumstick squashies. I hope it's squashies. I, I genuinely am not trying to mess up all the words, but that's how I would read it, I guess. It's squashies. Like squash -ies. Another OxyClean stain remover. One of the best minis in this series, to be honest, just based on the way it looks. Hey, we got some peeps. <laughs> Uh, I forgot that these are part of the series. We got ourselves some pink peeps. Not very crazy about these to be honest, but yeah, don't don't come after me in the comments. I know some of you like them. I was just saying how good the zippers are. <laughs> Okay, more dry shampoo. Never tried dry shampoo, but it sounds, I guess it's just like a temporary solution, right? Guys, I know I'm asking a lot of questions throughout the video, like you don't have to respond to all of them. I know sometimes it's overwhelming, but depending on what part you are in the video and when do you feel like commenting, yeah, feel free to answer one of the questions. Uh-oh, that looks like something new. We got the bomb burrito. I don't know why I thought this is chocolate. I see where my mind is going. I think this is one of those frozen burritos, right? I never heard of this and I never had it, but hey, in terms of many brands, this is a new one, so check mark. <gasps> no way. Oh my God. Guys, do you know what this is? <laughs> this is the this is finally the royal gelatin strawberry. Can't even get the words out anymore. But this is the regular one. This is not the glow in the dark one. Now, real quick, for those of you who don't know, Mini Brand Series 3 had the royal strawberry gelatin, you know, the regular one, and they had the glow in the dark one. Now, everyone found the glow in the dark one, but nobody was able to find, at least to my knowledge, the regular one. And this is the regular one, and I'm really sorry, but we're gonna go to the Mini Brand Series 3 collector's guide and mark this one on the list because as far as I know they made a mistake and that was never part of the series 3 thus being literally impossible for anyone to find it so now the only thing I'm missing to complete series 3 is the apple spice metallic wow this is crazy so yeah this goes to the series 3 collection maybe I shouldn't have done that Yeah, this looks like a new one. Yep, it is a new one. We got the orange strawberry sunny D drink. Kind of looks like it's hot sauce <laughs> based on the color. Or is it just me? Or maybe that's the way the camera picks it up. I don't know. Okay, I know in the previous foodie mini brands, we got our hopes high with some frozen moments because yeah, it wasn't that. But this feels like a big mini and it might be accessory, but I don't know. Let's see. <gasps> oh my God. Finally, I do not get my hopes high for nothing. Look at this. Let's 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 put this aside real quick. Okay, it is so cool to see like a gold Hershey syrup, which was part of series three, and actually see like a hole in it and you know with the cap open. So we got the Sunday, I think. Let's uh put it together real quick. Okay, and now let's put this on. Whoa, look at that. <laughs> that is so cool. 
I'm so glad I got one of these. And lucky for me, this is not the first Frozen Mini I got because one of you guys sent me another Frozen moment in a previous video. Um, thank you once again, Val. I know I said thank you like a thousand times, but yeah, this is actually the second Frozen moment mini that we have. It looks so cool and it, it's really hard to just put it down and move on to the next ball, but yeah, we gotta do it. We still have ways to go. All right, we got another Sunny D. This one is a little different. It's the Tangi, what? Tangi, my bad. Tangi original. That was bad, that was really bad. I'm not sure whether this is a new one or not to our collection, but either way, it's a pretty cool mini. Okay, we got some, uh, let's see, women's multivitamins from Vita Infusion. No, my bad, from Vita Fusion. Okay, that is another Hershey's milk chocolate. More frosted flakes from uh, Kellogg. Look at that. Now we got the gold peeps, or I guess yellow peeps. Looking pretty good. These are the classic ones, right? These are the, you know, original peeps. There you go, that's a nice surprise because it's a new one. We got the Kellogg's Fruit Loops. Love this cereal, to be honest. I know it's uh, it's not great, you know, it has all kinds of colors and stuff like that, but it's, it's really sugary, but you know, sometimes you just need to let go and have some fun, you know? We got another one of these Twizzlers, which is a double. Okay, this seems to, the, the dry shampoo seems to be really popular, or rather like really frequent. We got quite a few of these by now. And a box of Cheez-Its. Oh, it's actually cheez it I don't know why I thought they're called Cheez-Its. Once you start with the box of these, it's so hard to stop, isn't it? Like, these are very addictive. And we got the stash of cash. Got some $10 bills here. Mini brands money, that's what they call it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I guess that's an accessory. Yeah, I can tell it's a cash register. Anyway, let's uh, mark it on the list and move on. More tooth pain. I hope this is not a sign that I'm gonna have some toothaches. Okay, we got the Hershey's Miniatures. The guacamole. The holy moly guacamole. See, that could be their commercial song, right? <laughs> These are the minis. We used to have the, which is obviously just a box. Uh, series three used to have the ones that were that were solid plastic. But I did buy these when I did those videos where I eat, you know, the mini brands that I get because I couldn't find the regular ones, so I had to buy the mini ones. And yeah, and another hoisin duck from Itsu. Wish I could find some of these around here. I mean, I'm sure there's other brands, but yeah, it would be nice to actually try Itsu. And more money, but again, we just got the ten dollar bills. Okay, I thought this is the royal gelatin, but it's not. It's the sun made raisins, but this time we got the box. I think this is the small little box, right? Which obviously is very, you know, out of scale compared to the containers. Unless maybe they just came out with a cereal size box of raisins, who knows. Well, this looks new. A new mini, but at the same time new to my eyes because I, I never seen these before. They're the Swizzles Refreshers. Original lemon flavor. Again, I'm pretty sure Swizzles is a um, Great Britain company because I've never seen any of these here. Oh wow, this is cool. This is one of the minis that I really wanted to get in this series. It's the Cholula hot sauce. I mean, look at that details, guys. I like how they made the wooden, you know, cap. I don't think they had to make those specs over there because I don't remember seeing it like that through the bottle. But who knows, maybe I'm wrong. Honestly, I prefer the Chipotle Cholula over the original. There's something about that smoky flavor that's just, yeah, out of this world. Okay, we got some flavor ice. I think this is a different container from series three, right? Yeah, it looks that way. As opposed to series three where things were repeating from series two, at least in this series, we don't have any, you know, repeats, which is great. More Cheez-Its. Okay, we got some makeup in here. Powder blush from Revlon. Revlon. Darn it, these are really common. Yet another Hershey's Miniatures. 
Oh, this looks new. We got the push pop candy. Oh, this is the front. My bad. <laughs> Yeah, I never had this before. It seems like this is the strawberry flavor, so I'm guessing there's more flavors, possibly in this series. It's really cool to be introduced to new products like this through mini brands. I mean, I, I never knew about this one, for example. Finally, we got the Hitsu <laughs> Katsu rice noodles, but the regular one. I was afraid it's going to be the same thing like it happened with the mini brand series 3, where you can find the rare one, but not the regular one. Jeez, it's like every ball we've opened, we get a Cheez-Its. I wouldn't complain if they were real, but yeah. Trying to complete a collection here, you know? Uh-oh. Now this, I know for a fact, is actually huge. Unless there's smaller ones. We got the Rice Krispies Treats. Yeah, it is the big one because it says Treat Sheet. Your scale is a little bit off, but that's okay. It's a new mini. We'll take it. We got another one of the Itsu Katsu Rice Noodles. Hey, look at that, another Pringles. I like this mini so much. And I honestly wish it was a different type of Pringles now, because we already have the sour cream and onions. This is just me, or lately they just come up with a lot of hot flavors, like scorching this, scorching that. It's like just hot stuff. Like, why can't they just come with a regular flavor? And another box of cereal. The Kellogg's Fruit Loops. Okay, we got the regular OxyClean. We already have the gold one, which is very... I mean, I think we were really lucky to get that one. I don't know, I like gold, but to be honest, this looks better than the other one. It's probably because it's the real thing, you know, not the... There's no gold version out there in the real life. Alright, Teddy Grahams chocolate chip. This is definitely an accessory. Yep, that looks to be a shelf, and we're not gonna build it. Another push pop. Let's see, is it? Yeah, it's the same flavor. Another strawberry push pop. It's another burrito. Let's torture ourselves and be even more hungry. This is with beef, bean, and cheese sauce. Just added a little bit of lotion because my fingers were starting to get really dry from opening all of these. And yeah, it just doesn't look really good on camera, does it? There we go. That's a lot better. Feels better too. More raisins. Some people really love them and some people hate them. I personally like them, especially if they're in, you know, baked in something. Let's see, we got more uh, multivitamins from Vita Fusion. Uh oh, that looks new. We got the Morning Star Farms Veggie Original Sausage Patties. Never heard of them, but it looks like a cool mini. I honestly don't mind these type of minis as much as I do the, the boxes, the cardboard boxes. What about you? Which ones do you hate more? Um, these ones or the cardboard boxes? Okay, another holy guacamole. The miniature cups. I mean the mini cups. This is the miniature cup. <laughs> the mini cups are the ones that are in stores. And another OxyClean. America's number one versatile stain fighter. Hmm. Raisins seem to be really popular. Like, really, really popular. We got another Cholula. Oh, and I love this many. This would look nice as a necklace or earrings, right? No. Not the Whoppers. At least if it was the other ones, the Mal Maltesers or whatever they're called. I mean, whatever they're pronounced, I know what they're called. I'm just not sure exactly how you pronounce them. Okay, what is this? Oh, well, that's simple. This is the gloss. That's what it is. Lip gloss. I knew that. I knew that. I didn't know that until I, I read it. I had no clue. <laughs> and it seems like we got another accessory. I refuse to build it. Not, not today. Not today. Okay, this is another credit card terminal thingy. Pringles, more Pringles. I'm not complaining, I already said I love this mini, but I wish it was the other Pringles, you know? Okay, more Hershey's miniatures. We got quite a bit of these already. Uh-oh. Yep, new one. We got the Arm & Hammer baking soda. Now this is very familiar and nostalgic, to be honest. Yeah. <laughs> and we got more peeps. This time we got the... What is it, like purple? Yeah, we got the purple peeps. Obviously it's a new one, but you know what I'm curious? Yeah, so I was curious to see if we actually got all of them, and it seems like we did. <laughs> that is cool. 
And even though this guide is pretty, we have our own guide, so let's go ahead and mark it over there. Wait, this time, is anyone wondering what's up with those numbers over there where you didn't even notice them? Well, I can't tell you yet because it's part of a bigger video I'm creating and it's gonna be a while until I can say anything about that. But if it works out, this is going to be one of the best videos. So if you're not subscribed, I suggest you click that subscribe button, click the notification bell so that whenever that video gets posted, you're not missing it. You know what, if you can guess why I put those numbers there, I'm gonna tell you. Just leave it in a comment, and if it's the right answer, I'm gonna say yes. If it's the wrong answer, I'm just gonna say no. Oh, this is brand new mini, but it's kind of very similar to the ones from series one. If I can find the picture, I'm gonna pull it up and put it right here. And now look at this next to it, right? Honestly, I prefer if mini brands would just do food items instead of, you know, hygiene items and all that, but what are you gonna do? I think there's two different shades to this, you know, specific mini, but I'm pretty sure we have this one. It's the Revlon Color Stay. Is it something you put on for when you try to get a tan and you're sitting in the sun or something? That's not what it says. I think that's what it is, right? Well, it seems like we got a new burrito flavor. This is the Bomb Burrito Beef and Bean Spicy, Spicy Red Hot. Yeah, no, thank you. Right now, I would go with the other one. I think it was beans and beef and cheese and stuff like that. Okay, we got some laundry detergent. Extra Mountain Rain. Yeah, I'm familiar with this one. Oh. <gasps> No way. I don't know if we're lucky or it's just, you know, common to get the frozen moments, but we got another one. This is a pretty big one too. I mean, the plate is big and it's it's pretty heavy. It seems like we got some tortilla chips and then this is, I'm guessing, salsa. Oh yeah, that's my type of salsa. Thick and chunky. Oh, this comes off too. Well, that's interesting. Let's put the salsa here. There we go. I really love everything that's like a frozen moment in time, you know? Sometimes you see cakes that are done like that. I'm honestly very pleased, like out of this whole case, so far we got two frozen moments and, you know, a couple more rare ones, which I think is really great, so. Okay, more OxyClean, looking good, really nice mini. This is the dry shampoo. We're gonna get a lot of repeats moving forward, I think, because the more you open, the more you have, the more repeats you get. Okay, more burritos. Oh, this is a different one. <laughs> I think we have all of them by this point. Oh no, it's not a different one. Why did I think that? Wait a second. It is a new one. Okay, because the other one was green. This is red. And this is, uh, this is purple. Beef, bean, and cheese sauce. So it's the same. Oh, I get it. The chilies are different. This has red chilies. Okay, more OxyClean. This is the stain remover. One of the best minis in the series, in my opinion. Especially in the common category, you know? Because obviously there's nothing better than a frozen moment, to be honest. Uh-oh. We have another new one. We got the Sunmade Dried Organic Mango. I didn't try the Sunmade version, but if you guys never tried, you know, the dried mango, I suggest you find the company that, you know, makes those and, and give it a try. It's like little mango slices that are dried and it's so good. Someone from work actually got me to try some and I'm not a big fan of fruits in general, but I'm like, okay, I'm gonna try it. And it was, it was actually really good. Mm-hmm. Accessory that we're not gonna build. Seems to be the cash register. And it will rest right over here until we're ready mentally to build them. Okay, more baking soda. See, this is really weird because it's a box and I don't like boxes, but probably the fact that I'm really familiar with this makes me like it, even though it's just a cardboard box. I guess if it's something you use or you used in the past, you kind of get attached to it in a way and then you like the mini, because otherwise I cannot explain it. Man, listen, these Hershey miniatures are everywhere. Like whenever I see a capsule that has a collector's guide in it, I'm pretty sure that, you know, I find one of these. Uh-oh, I see something new. Once again, we have another Arm & Hammer product and this is Clean Sensations. And it's, um, what is it? It's that thing you put in, you know, when you do your laundry, you put it in to, to give it a nice smell and also like a nice, I don't know, feel like it makes them softer. And we have more peeps. Whenever I see these, I just think of Easter. They're usually everywhere around Easter. 
Yeah, Mike and Ike. I haven't seen this in a while, I guess in series three, but it seems like this is a different one. I mean, slightly different, you know, it's the Berry Blast. It's kind of funny how they display the flavors on the side there. It looks like they're buttons on a controller or on a screen. It's like a microwave or something. Okay. So whenever you get a guide, you usually get a burrito or Hershey's miniatures or Twizzlers or something like that. I feel like I'm kind of losing my voice. I don't know, like from the moment I started the video until now, my voice has been becoming kind of like raspier and raspier. I think I'm getting a little bit tired. I mean, we're going to finish. Don't worry. I'm not, I'm not stopping right here. That would be the ultimate teaser, right? But just so you kind of get an idea of how much time this takes, or at least how much time it takes me right now, looking at the camera, I am at one hour and 55 minutes. Okay. One of those, we're going to call this the invisible mini. If it's in there, like if you look from certain angles, you know what, never mind. I think I'm too tired. That's why it's the invisible mini for me. We got the hand sanitizer. That's what we got. Shelves. Yeah, they're definitely not getting built. More OxyClean. And it becomes oxy obvious that this is really popular. We might get a lot more of these in the future. All right, this is the last ball. And if you want to leave me a comment, but don't know what to say, tell me this. Are you still here? Is anyone still here watching? Because I think this video is going to be pretty long. And if you're still here, thank you so much. It means a lot to me. And this seems to be a shopping cart. The only difference is it's, it's pink and white rather than whatever color the other ones were. More Cholula. I wish they would have made all the other ones as well, you know, have the other flavors too. But even like this, I think this is an amazing mini. I feel like my voice is getting worse and worse. This is crazy. Let's see. Whoops. No, it fell exactly next to the other one and I'm not sure which one was it. I'm pretty certain that it was the green one that we got in this. Oh, I just got an alert that we have low battery. So good thing we just have two of these. Daddy Grams, chocolatey chip and the last pod. Doesn't feel like a frozen moment, but it might be something good still, right? Oh, I mean, yeah, it's a new one. Little Critters Gummy Vites. Again with the Vites, man. Why do you call them like that? So it's a daily multivitamin for kids. I actually like this one more than the other ones that are for adults. Like the way they look, right? As a mini. Yeah, I think this is the only edible mini in the series that I'm not craving right now, but everything else, yeah, I'm really craving it. I just want to say, if you're still here watching this video, thank you so much. I really appreciate it. It means a lot to me and I'm not going to keep you for much longer. Just wanted to say, don't forget to leave me a comment. I asked a ton of questions in this video. I know you can just pick one and answer it. And if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to leave a like because it helps my channel a lot. And that means I can keep doing videos like these. And last but not least, if you're not subscribed, consider doing so and clicking that bell so you get notified whenever I post a new video. That's about it. Now your golden boy is going to go get something to eat and relax for the rest of the evening. Meanwhile, you guys stay golden until the next video. Bye bye.